in today's lesson we are learning about inequality okay inequality means you can't see um, like uh, let's write down here inequality first inequality okay so like x less than 3 x greater than 3 or x less than and equal to 3 and x greater than or equal to 3 so you can't see sign of equal you can see greater than sign less than sign or less than and equal to sign and greater than or equal to sign so this is less than x is less than 3 it is x greater than 3 x less than and equal to 3 and x greater than or equal to 3 so you should uh, know about the points if there is a dark point it means that point is included and if there is a white point like this then we can say it is excluded okay so let's uh, see a couple of example so if this is number line here yeah? and uh, let's write down here in the middle zero and this side is one and this side is two and this side is three and here it is minus one minus two and minus three and so on so this is our number line okay and our question is you need to show x less than three and greater than and equal to minus one okay this is our question this we need to show okay so we are going to keep these points in our mind okay so less than 3 so there is no equal sign so we are going to make white circle like this here yeah? we will not shade it so x less than 3 minus 1 there is a equal sign you can see where i am putting this line blue line equal sign so it means this point is included so whenever there is a equal sign it means that point is included we make dark circle and these are the points okay so this is your answer yeah or if you they ask you to write down the solution set so we write down within the bracket so minus one there is a equal sign so minus one is included then zero is included then one is included and two and less than three it means three is not included excluded so here it is clear okay let's see uh, let's see one more question now hmm? so if question is like this x greater than 2 so again we draw a number line here okay and greater than 2 means it is 0 it is 1 and it is 2 and it is 3 and it is 4 and so on yeah so greater than 2 means first you need to see whether this point is included or excluded let me know whether it is included or excluded guys i'm asking whether this point is included or excluded 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 because there is no equal sign here this there is no equal sign like this here so it is excluded okay so x greater than 2 so make 2 select 2 sorry and greater than 2 means we are going this side greater than 2 okay so all these points will be your answer here yeah? or if you need to write down the solution set so 2 is excluded so just don't count then 3 4 and so on okay let's see one more example if it is x less than and equal to 5 okay less than and equal to 5 so let's draw a number line okay and uh, in the middle it is 0 it is 1 2 3 4 and 5 and this is minus 1 and minus 2 okay so less than 5 means 5 is included or excluded Included. included because there is a equal sign so 5 included it is less than value so all these values you are taking okay and it will keep on going so if you need to write down the solution set here so 5 is included then 4 is included then 3 then 2 then 1 
then 0 and minus 1 and it will keep on going okay so this is uh, our solution set yeah now question comes first example question comes like this okay 2x plus 3 less than and equal to 5 okay or let's take less than equal to 8 okay 2x plus 3 um, oh, sorry less than equal to 9 okay and here I'm taking another question uh, 2x plus 3 less than and equal to 9 okay so let's solve it so treat this less than sign as a equal sign so 2x if we do minus 3 both side so 9 take away 3 is 6 now divide by 2 both side so x is less than 3 okay is that fine so x is less than 3 and if we solve here so minus 3 both sides so 2x less than and equal to minus 3 and minus 3 so it is 6 divided by 2 both sides so x less than and equal to 3 so you can see the difference okay you can see the difference here okay so here let's write down as 0 then the 1 then 2 and then 3 and here it is 0 and then 1 and 2 and 3 if you want you can include few negative numbers it doesn't matter minus 1 minus 2 this is our number line okay so first thing is x less than 3 so 3 is not included okay and all values less than 3 so it means we are going for this side okay and uh, here x greater than and equal to x less than and equal to 3 so this point is included because of this sign okay and all these values are going in this direction is that okay is that okay guys yeah okay yeah. let's uh, yeah let's see one more question example 2 2x plus 3 over 4 and here less than and equal to 5 or let's take 6 here yeah? oh, 7 yeah so okay so there is nothing there so suppose there is one and we do cross multiply cross multiply means you are multiplying this side and you are multiplying this side okay so once you multiply if you multiply by 1 with 2x plus 3 so it is 2x plus 3 and 4 times 7 is 28 now you can do minus 3 both side okay once you do minus 3 both side so we got here 28 take away 23 is 25 and divide by 2 both side so it is 12.5 5 okay so what will happen here 12.5 okay if you need to show on a number line so you can show like this like 0 then 1 then 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 let's extend it 9 10 11 and 12 and 12.5 12 will be here somewhere and that point is included so this is 12.5 okay so it is included this point is included I have made a black circle here and all these points will be part of solution set okay now i'm going to give you some questions that you need to try okay okay so here are two questions please try to answer now so you can check your answers now so here is number line and uh, write down all the where n is an integer okay so it is uh, minus one zero one two three so three is included point 
and minus 1 is excluded and you can join them okay and write down all the possible values of n so all the possible values of n will be uh, 0 1 2 and 3 okay now here in this question 4x less than or equal to x plus 6 if you do minus x both side so we got 3x less than or equal to 6 divide by 3 both side so we got x less than and equal to 2 and uh, we can draw it on number line so this is 0 this is 1 and 2 and this side minus 1 okay minus 2 so 2 is included here so let's make a dark circle here and all the values less than 2 so all these values it will keep on going okay guys here are two questions and you have three minutes to solve this please start solving so let's check answer if you have tried please check your working with my working so if you multiply 3 with n uh, with n plus 1 so it is 3 n plus 3 less than 24 now you can do minus 3 both side if you do minus 3 both side, 24 take away 3 is 21 and you divide by 3 both side. So it will be n less than 7. Okay. And you can show it on number line. It is not asked, but I'm showing you. Okay. So it is suppose 0, then it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven. Yeah, you yeah, so you okay, so now you can hear. Sorry about that. So uh, here, you, here your answer will finish here. But I'm just showing you how to show it on the number line. So it is seven. Seven is not included. So just make a this circle, and all these values less than seven are part of its solution set. Okay, now. Let's go for this question. 4 times 2 is 8x plus 4 and it is 9. Let's do minus 4 both sides here. So it will be 8x. 9 take away 4 is 5. Now, okay, so 5. Now divide by 8 both sides. So x less than 5 over 8 here. Can you divide? 5 by 8 what you are getting please do it for me so x greater than 0 0.625 if you need to show this on number line which you no need to just i'm showing you okay so it will be like this okay and uh, let's write down here it is 0 and it is 1 and it is 2 and 3 and so on 0 0.6 will be somewhere here yeah uh, let's mark here it is 0 0.5 then 0 0.6 will be somewhere here okay and we can make a white circle and uh, all these values greater than okay so i hope you have understood the concept here yeah. now uh, if you have any question please write down in a comment column i'm just going to upload this video okay and uh,